welcome and welcome back to my channel so in today's video i'm getting rid of these braids they have run that course they have the time has been exceeded and i think it's time to just get rid of them but they were so gorgeous well they are still so gorgeous it's just they have been here for too long so i'm gonna cut them first and then start unbraiding and i don't know how long this is gonna take because they're very very skinny and there's a million of them but wish me luck i just looked at my hair and i think this here would be the perfect place to just snip it off but i think i'm gonna cut my hair i think my hair is this long because i kept them for so long what do you guys think oh my god okay just gonna do it it's done <laughs> so i'm gonna try to match all of them to this same length and then see if i didn't cut my hair or not but it's fine <laughs> would this be a look it's a look baby it's a look okay let me start unbraiding it now I just did one and I feel like yeah this is probably gonna take more than a day to finish I did one and there's like 500 left so I'm gonna take a break now the next day and i'm gonna continue unbraiding i didn't finish last night because i was so tired and it was getting so dark so the lighting was not too great so i decided let me just sleep and <laughs> the state of my hair <laughs> okay so i did half and i'm left with this little half not too much left I managed to finish all this part all the way. More than half of the hair actually. So I'm just left with this little square here. Hopefully I can finish in like an hour or two. Maybe three. And then I'm going to wash my hair. And blow dry it. Then prepare it for braiding. Because I'm going to attempt to braid my hair by myself. But this is where I'm at so let's get back to it i have my handy dandy red tail come here with me and i want to i think it's best to start from the back and tie the rest in the front <laughs> So I'm now left with just three braids and I'm going to be done very soon. It's now 12.56 and I've been at it for three hours. So after this, I'm going to go ahead and wash my hair, then blow dry it. Then I think I'll braid it again. I'm not quite sure, but we'll see how I feel after the, the wash. If I'll still be tired, then I'm not braiding it. Thank <laughs> you. 
try to brush my hair out before I go and wash it so I can get the knots out. Oh. I know it's not good to brush your hair dry, but like it's not dry. I had moisturizer in it. It's just not that wet. But it has grown a lot actually. Oh my lord. This is such a good brush though. Love that it's like flexible. It's not like too abrasive or too harsh. I can't believe how much my hair has grown actually. This is crazy. This is insane. Oh lord. And I could put it in a bag. Okay, this looks ridiculous. But yeah. I'm gonna go ahead and wash it. Look at the state of that comb. This that month of hair I lost. Oh my lord, that is not a good look. But I'm gonna take out my shampoo and show you guys. So I got these from Boots last year, and I never really used the shampoo because I had a different one, but it finished. So I'm gonna be using this. It's a coconut and almond shampoo, and it's conditioner. I got these for like two euro, and I didn't even pay for it because I had my Boots card and it had money in there, so I just swiped them with the Boots card. And here it is. I love the conditioner last time I used it. Left my hair very moisturized and I noticed less breakage after using it. We'll see about the shampoo. But coconut is always a good sign because natural hair, my natural hair is very dry and breaks easily. But whenever I use coconut oil or coconut stuff, it doesn't break as much. So we'll see. And then I moisturize using Kentu products. Let me show them to you just now. I use this even when I have braids, but it says um, it's it defines and softens. So I guess it's like more of like a definition and um, detangling solution. And then this is the spray one. Um, I use it when I had braids and they were good. Then for my hair oil, I usually use um, black castor oil. And this is the one that I'm currently loving. I got it when I was home, when I was in Botswana. So this is the oil. It's a 10. I should make a separate video of like my hair products. And because there's like 10 more. And I use them simultaneously. So I just got back from the shower and washing my hair. And I wanted to show you guys how much hair I lost and this is ever since i started using that condition i just showed you in the past clip this is it this is all of it <laughs> this is it this such a significant improvement ever since i started using that conditioner from boots 10 out of 10 i recommend i'm never leaving i am never leaving but now i'm going to blow down my hair then moisture up but it is what it is and this is where we're at now <laughs> I'm just gonna quickly do my skincare and then maybe moisturize my hair and braid it. I'm not, I'm not really, we'll see. I'm gonna use this little toner by Pasha M and my handy dandy cotton pad. Put a little in there and just put it all over my face. My current favorite is La Roche Posay. This one. And then I use that sunscreen as well. This one. Best ever. So far, I've not had a sunscreen that's as good as this sunscreen. Doesn't break me out, doesn't leave me looking greasy, but still does the job. And my hyperpigmentation has become 10 times better since i've started using this spf of course with other products but like spf very important so i'll just moisturize really quickly right now and yeah i think i will braid my hair ouch I just scratched myself i think i will braid my hair 
because the maintenance of having it like this and with the weather here the rainy humid it'll just not be ideal <laughs> Looking like a glazed donut. This is the hair that I bought. Excuse me. This is the hair that I bought. It's this expression collection ultra braid in the color one, so pure black. And I got three of them. I do want to curl my braids at the end though. Stressed. I just wish I could just go sit somewhere and have somebody do all this for me. But not for 150 euro. That is crazy. This is how the hair looks. I'm just going to cut it. I'm wondering if I should cut it into two pieces or three pieces. But I'm not looking for anything long, so I'll cut it into three pieces. Three will do. <laughs> to get my first braid it's not the best but it could be worse okay this is what we're working with and so far so good Last night I caved and I was like, I can't do this anymore. I'm too tired, so I slept at around one. So I'm back at it. I'm back at it again. I'm just gonna finish my skincare and then go back to braiding. <laughs> 